I'm not even going to let that uh, go to the startup because that was kind of lame. Sorry, guys. That was a pain in the ass, huh? I wonder if that's why I was having those issues with the um, the other program I was telling you about. I'm not even making a note. All right. Hey, at least I sent out the alert again, too. So that was definitely that issue, too. So, hey, two problems solved. I guess that's what the startup is all about, right? Learning. Sorry to make you guys sit there and go through that, though. It wasn't fun, either. That's I guarantee you that's what the issue was having. Remember I was telling you I couldn't get that other program working? It's because the group is private, so it, it wasn't even allowing that program into it. Yeah, now I have all the share options and all that. And we can still control everything, so I set all the options before I before I did all that. So we'll be approving comments and posts and well not comments, but we'll be appro uh approving posts, members. I put the questions in. I don't know. He said something about a pie. I'm going to have to look back because I think he, he misspelled something, but he said, did you put a something for Facebook advertisement? But I think it, it was a missing a letter or something because it didn't, it didn't make sense. I had to reread it. Yeah, let me share now. I make sure I share it to the right group, though, because I don't want to get banned out of a group. I did that before. Yeah, I'm trying to remember. I can't see comments right now. It's not even showing it on that screen, so the comments. Isn't that weird? I might, I might just keep it there. I'm not sure. But it does make it a little more of a pain in the ass. All right. Hopefully I didn't share it to the wrong one. Because I know one of them is an instant ban if you share. I've only got a couple of groups. Oops. I also shared it to the private group in case anybody was wondering. Okay. Well, that might have knocked that camera off a little.
We'll see. Yeah, it's definitely a lot better though. Let me turn that down a little. All right, so like I said earlier, we have, um, there's at least three hits left in the Chrome Jumbos. Those are 33 a pack. Um, the only other box I have open for packs right now is the Chronicles. There is five packs left in there and there was no hit taken yet. So that's 35 a pack, 200 a box. I got Luminance for a 210. $55 a pack. I got Contenders 2018 and 2019 at 180 a box. I got the Bowman Chrome from this year, 2020. Two, 25 for the whole box. Uh, 120 for a mini. I've got Mosaic Basketball 2019, 2020 for a 525 for the box or a 45 a pack. This year's Prism, 185 a box. I got Absolute Baseball, 180 a box, 95 a mini. Gypsy Queen, 210 a box. All this is hobby. The only thing that's not hobby is the, the Mosaic Cellos over there and the Chronicles right here. Other than that, everything's all be up there. I do have some older hockey there. It's 2014, 2015. That is 275 a box. That actually has uh, three autos in it. And that's the authentic SP. Alan Ginter, 140 a box. I have Legacy for 205 a box. I can get a lot of these different college ones too, guys. These are the uh, 24 packs. There's two hits in there. A bunch of different colleges. It's good at least we fixed that though. I was wondering because there was no share button on my thing. And I was like, what the hell? You do want to see any prices just go on the group page too if uh, or you can just ask and I'll tell you I got these Chronicles down here 2019 2020 basketball 300 a box or 25 a pack the prism quick pitch is 105 
Hey, did you ever open up that Ohio State one? You never told me if you did or not. Or if you got anything good out of it. Guys, I got the Bowman Chrome for a 225 a Master Box and 120 a Mini. I will break those up. Luminance, 210 a box, 55 a pack. I do have some pro debut up there too. I got the 2020 at 105 and the 2019 at 140. Gypsy Queen at 210. Like I said, there's only been one hit um, out of this that I know about, the Bowman uh, Jumbos. There may have been two out of it, but I'm going to say there's three hits in there. There's most definitely three hits in there. The 2020 Chronicles Baseball, the 35 a pack. There are five packs left in that first box, and there's no hits taken out of it. Were they anybody good, though, Adam? There was actually a kid local to me that went to Ohio, Ohio State for a little bit. Um I think he went to actually went to BC first, and then I think he transferred to Ohio State. His name was uh, Scooney Penn. He was actually a pretty good ball player too, basketball. He was pretty highly rated around here, and I'm pretty sure he went to BC first and then transferred out to Ohio State. That's good you got the two autos though. I got opened up a box and I got a um I got a relic in one and a auto in the other. Yeah, they're still cool. I mean they're not a ton of money, so but it's nice if you hit like one of the big guys. Like I know for Auburn I'd love to hit the the Frank Thomas one. That'd be a nice one to have. At least we're working the bugs out last night and tonight. Tonight was a big one. That was actually good. Yeah, they do. They definitely do. If I remember right, he played for a couple of years, but that was it. Got to get that music playing. I think now that we did this, I can actually try that other program now. So tomorrow I'll try the other one just to see if I can't get that working. It'd be nice with the scrolling thing up top too. I think I, well, lucky we didn't have a ton of stuff already on that, that private page. I didn't have to move too much stuff over. I'm pretty sure I turned off all the comments on everything that uh, we don't want comments on.
the um, new contenders, I think, come out in another month or month and a half for the baseball. Those would be nice. I think it's a month. If I remember right. I was looking earlier at all the releases coming up. And those are nice because you get an auto in every pack. I think she just let me know the, uh, yep, the website's all set, ready to go too. So I wouldn't go there right now and look at it. It's going to look kind of funny because there's things on there that I got it, like pictures that she put with just a generic. But it's you can at least check it out at least. I'm pretty sure she published it. I just want to check it real quick. I'm sorry. Hold on one second. Because I think she was messing with the... Yeah, she did. Okay, good. She had the um, the background white instead of black. But I think once she saw our website, she realized it was... Uh, it was different. I'm going to have to tell her I changed the, uh, yeah, definitely. I keep seeing it spike up a little and then go back down, but. I definitely want to, like I was thinking about what you said earlier, and I, I, I'm i definitely not going to put that on eBay because I don't feel like dealing with that. eBay is just kind of bad right now for cards. I don't want to throw a case on there, and some guy sent me back a box of books. I was reading that on one of the scammers pages today. Yeah, I saw him a little while ago. He said he was going to get something um, next week. Oh, I didn't see PJ, though. It's not showing me, like like I said earlier, I've got the three monitors going. It's not showing me anybody that's logging in. Yeah, it's weird. And I'm trying to even hover over the... No, it's saying we're having trouble playing this video. Hmm. That Gypsy Queen hobby box is a steal. Actually, the prices are pretty good up there and everything. I was looking around today. It's pretty close on everything, like at some of the big places. Yeah, it's weird. It's not showing nothing on mine. I noticed the delay's a lot lower, though. It's not as bad as it was yesterday.
Hey, what's going on, Kyle? There's got to be an app I can put on this um, software, too, that'll let me know who's popping in and out. Because Facebook seems to be hit or miss. It was letting me see yesterday who was popping in on one of them, but the other one it wasn't. And now today, it's just the... Uh, I shared it to that baseball um, card group. The What is it called? Let me see. That one I showed you the other day. I had like um, 22,000 members. I'll share it over there. Doing good. Just trying to work out the kinks. That was kind of crazy earlier. Wasn't as bad yesterday when the mouse locked up, though. That was kind of weird. But today, the um, that's good to know, though, that it was because of the private group. Oh, I remember when it first came out, I was stream, I was gaming, uh, streaming a lot of my games, and Facebook was like a no-no. It was horrible. I used to use just Twitch, Twitch and um, YouTube. Yeah, I was thinking about it, and I know, um, I know YouTube does that too. They actually sent me something today. From uh, no, it's definitely a good idea. That's all they do, you know. I was kind of bummed out I didn't get you a hit yesterday in that pack. I think for the first, um, at least weekend, I was kind of happy to have, uh, yeah, it's actually, I, when I, one of my classes, they were going over that, and it was, I was surprised at the pricing, how cheap it is. I mean, as you go up in, in tiers, I'm sure it, it bounces. But I kind of like it, you know, the first weekend, I don't want to have like 20 people, 30 people on, and I'm having all kinds of issues. That, that would be horrible. I'd rather work out the kinks right now. No, I appreciate it. Yeah, I got the um, absolute football coming in next weekend, too. That gets released on the 7th. And that guy's not like my other wholesaler that takes, uh, you know, a week after release it comes in. That was kind of crappy. I almost want to write him and just ask him what, what was that all about. He's already selling it for cheaper. It's like, you want to give me that price lower now? He's very responsive though. Like as soon as it's funny because he's horrible with this ship and he's horrible with like he sent me the wrong order once. Luckily, I, I needed it, so I was like, "Yeah, I'll buy it." And then he took still never even sent me the other things. I had to actually get a refund on it. I'm glad I I bought a bunch of it. That's the only um. So, what I'm gonna do with the retail, like I was telling Adam, is I am gonna get some retail stuff. Um, but I'm not paying these, you know, these crazy, like, uh, flipping prices. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the retail on the website. So I will get like a bunch of the stuff coming out in the retail, but I'll put it on the website for sale on there. And if somebody really, you know, gets something good or whatever they, they want it ripped, I'll rip it online. But for the most part, it's going to be a, uh, get it right out. You want the stadium club? There's two of them there. Did you you want to pick one of them? One twenty, on that one. One twenty on the stadium club. That's got two autos, on card.
Yeah, I love the pitchers in Stadium Club. All right, I'm gonna take the uh, the one behind so I don't knock everything else down. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna take the one in the front. I lied. No, there we go. We'll take the one in behind. I thought it was holding the case up. That would have been kind of silly. All right, so there you go. Just make sure this I did hit it earlier. Almost knocked it off the setting. Yeah, so she let me know the website's ready, so I can't wait to get on there. I'll adjust everything on that and get the pictures going tomorrow. And set it up for the voting. Alright, well, let's hope we get you a good good auto. Are right, you ready for this? Oh, I know. Did he tell you last night about the um, the weight that he had on his uh, on his drill burrows? He knew he was going to get them, but it took a while before we got them, and then it was a nice one that he got too. <clears throat> that was definitely worth the wait. Although, like I said, I was going through your cards today, and it was I was pretty. Um, I think I was so so dead on looking for the the burrows that I didn't look at anything else. And you did. You got one of those um, the white ones. You know what it was? It was the Terrell Davis out of twenty five. Oh, you did. All right. So here's your big card. It goes one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and sixteen. So there's your empty box with a little foam, little foam in there. I gotta stop hitting the camera. All right, let's see what this one is. These are a pain in the ass to ship. I'm, I'm glad you're getting a box. Oh, oh, hey, who's your um? This is your PC. This is one of your PCs, so you're already making out. You'll like this one. I know this is one of your PCs because I think you you mentioned them before to me. Uh, yeah, Kino. That's a nice card. I'll package that up nice for you. I learned how to ship these things now. All right, so there's your first uh, hit without even opening them, right? There's a Lizardo. Some of those big, like the off-size cards, I know in the older stuff, they're hard to find because people just threw them out and got rid of them. Used them for target practice. This one feels like a, it's got a little, little something in there. Yeah, these pitches are awesome. Like, look at that. It's not like filled with other stuff, you know what I mean? Like, 
Let me fix this camera too, by the way. I'm sorry. It's bothering me. It fell down earlier. And I did not readjust it. It just feels like it's too low. There we go. Yeah, that's better. <clears throat> I know there are uh, photo variations because I was looking that up before and some of them are worth some money actually. Yeah, I know there was some photo variations. I'm going to pull it up on the other screen just so I can take a look while I'm going through them. I know there was a, um, like a Jordan Alvarez. They had them in two different. Yeah, there's a bunch of them. There's a McGuire. Yeah, we'll have to take a look for him. Keep an eye out on him. I didn't open many of these yet either, so. Kershaw. Yeah, they're all action shots for the most part. Carlos Santana. There's a Barry Larkin. I don't know if you're a total Cincinnati fan or just a Aquino fan. I actually get a nice Aquino autograph too. I'll let you know if, if you're interested. why but every time I hear these packs I'm, I'm gonna say it and I don't mean to say it again but it just reminds me of some kind of SMR stuff we're gonna have to start a second channel for that I see people giving those people money too I don't know I don't want to sit there and watch somebody chewing food on a on an open video Hey, don't say unfortunately. I was kind of glad when Griffey went there. I just, I wish they could have done a lot better with him there. I was psyched to see him get out of Seattle. You know, my theory on, on the whole Seattle thing is I feel A-Rod just screwed up. Because he did the same thing to Texas, you know. And then look at the Yankees. The Yankees didn't win a lot while he was there, which is kind of weird for them. Oh, crap. There's an autograph right there. And I think it's a nice one. I don't know if you saw it. I'm pretty sure you might have. But we're going to act like you didn't. Rosario. I'm going to check the backs on them. I don't think there's anything on the back that will show. But I'll go through them before I send them to. Or if you see any of the variations. These are beautiful, though. Sunny Gray. Is a Conseco. All right, so he has a members only. I mean, definitely an insert, but I know they used to have, um, oh, what was it? When they first come out, there was a, not a members only, but it was similar to that. 
Is that different? Did you already get one of these? Was that different? No. Zach Collins. I, here's a Kyle Lewis. See, this is a this is one of the you get to looking into the pictures and you like. You know what? I don't know why this did that again. Hold on, I'm sorry. I don't know why this focus keeps doing this on this camera. I turn the autofocus off. There we go. That's better. Sorry about that, guys. That was crappy, huh? So there you go, Kyle Lewis. Oh, some are numbered on the back. Okay. I'll take a look then. Al Kaline. El Tuve. Wainwright, Gary Sanchez, oh, sorry about that, is another Cincinnati guy, let's turn that over, and that's not a auto, but it's a, uh, it's a red parallel, that's kind of dirty to do that, we're so used to the uh, autos being that way, Ty Cobb, Roberto Elema. Well, that's an old picture of him, too. Berrios. That's kind of an awkward for Ichiro. That's a, that's got to be a photo variation right there. I'm almost positive that's a, a photo variation. Let me look real quick. What's the number on it? <clears throat> number 244. Yep, it is. That's a photo variation. Yeah, it's usually the weird ones that aren't the, the regular pictures from what I'm seeing. Tucker. There's a nice Mike Trout. Murphy. Nice trout for you. Yeah, these are nice cards. I like these. So maybe that wasn't an auto I saw earlier. There's a Gavin Lux. You Darvish. It's hard to see some of these. George Springer. I think I'm gonna have to put my uh my glasses on. That's kinda awkward. Byron Buxton. Oh, there's a Vladdy backwards, but it's not going to be a auto. And if it is, that's sick. But Goldschmidt, full. Let's turn that puppy around. Nope, it's not an auto, but it's a. It's got the um, Stadium Club in the black. So I know that's a parallel. Not numbered, but it is a parallel. Chewing bubblegum, Justin Dunn. Haniger. Pete Alonzo. Yeah, it's hard to tell. Like I think the all the photo variations that I'm seeing online are when they're not in uniforms. Which would make sense because that's what that Fernando Tatis. Yadier Molina. Oh, there's one of your autos right there. I didn't even see it. Ryan Reynolds. Try to turn it a little. 
Like I said, these are on card too, which is nice. And the, oh, that's a blue one. I don't think I've seen a blue one yet. A blue parallel. Sorry, I'm just trying to adjust this. It should be showing better. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think I've seen one of these blue ones yet. Oh, it is numbered too. It is out of 50. Looks like 38 out of 50. Can't get it close enough. Yeah, 38 out of 50. So that's good to know. I was going to say, because I haven't seen a blue one yet. That's what I thought too, but... Nope. Alex Young. Christian Walker. Zach Granky batting. All right, this has a Liberty Bell on it. This is a um, Aaron Nola, but it's it's a Liberty Bell. That's gonna be an insert. Not numbered. Willie Mays. There's a Nico Horner. Freddie Freeman. And Kaboom. Oh, that's a red one too. Nice. And the red ones aren't numbered either. So it's it's it looks like the blue ones and I'm guessing the um I think this what is there? Gold or let me see. Yeah, so there's red, black, the sepia, the black and white hobby um, is in the hobby. I'm going to have to go through that again just to make sure that one wasn't numbered. But uh, And then the blue foil is out of 50. The rainbow is out of 25. The first day issue is out of 10. And then the members only is uh, one per case. Photographer's proof is... Uh, It looks like both that and golden rainbow foil is out of one. So those are the ones you want. I'm going to double check that black one though. Just make sure it wasn't a black and white because I didn't see a number on it though. Trevor Bauer. Joey Votto. I wonder if that's a photo variation. I mean, it's a different uniform, but um. One thirty one. Nope, not a photo variation. Chris Davis, Victor Robles, oh, here comes something good. Roberto Clemente, that's a nice picture. Chuck Peterson. Oh, he has a Daryl Strawberry. Nice. I know he's not your PC, but Daryl is the man. I'm actually going to put that in the insert one. I can't not sleeve up Daryl. That's a cool picture. I thought it was going to be a special card at first, like an insert. There's a showy. David Dahl. Jorge Posada. Okay, I thought that one looked different for a second there. Anthony K. Michael Chavez. Looks like he's floating. Dale Murphy. Jeez. All right, here's a Blake Snell backwards. Backwards, Blake Snell is the Heroes of the Zone. 
Blake Snell, no number on it. Bagwell. He was supposed to be a uh, superstar with the Red Sox instead of with the, the Astros. AJ Puck. It's a nice one. There's that Barry Larkin. Keston Hira. Jalen Davis. Xander, he's the man. I hope they don't trade him. I hope they don't trade him. I'll be kind of upset. I was upset with Mookie, but I'll be even more upset with that. Uh, Will Clark, that's going to be a, oh, that's a red too. Let me see, that's going to be a photo variation right there. What was the number on that? 200. No, it's not, wow. I was almost positive that was going to be. I'm going to have to go through them again, though, and check the numbers. Adrian Lohan. Carlos Santana. Robo Garcia. Nick Marquesas. Wow, he... Another one of the ones that were hurt this year, Eduardo Rodriguez. He had a good year last year, too. Oh, there's a nice nice showy out of 50, 47 out of 50. But DJ LeMay, he was first. It's hard to hide these. Let's see what it is. It is a wings in the wings. And that is... Number up in the corner. Oop, try to get that light off that. Sorry. 47 out of 50. These can go in the top of there. Yeah. And then these can all just go in there. Here's another. Actually, this in the wings looks better than that uh, showy, and the showy's numbered. This one's not. Isn't that weird? This one's got like a little foil on it. The showy didn't have any of that. But the showy was numbered, so we'll say that's better. Machada. Nice strikeout in the World Series a few years ago. Ryan Sandberg. Jorge Soler. Seth Brown. Oh, that's a nice Ichiro. That's a nice looking Ichiro right there, too. Oh, I, I don't know if you can see that, but it doesn't feel like it. Maybe it's part of the picture. I'm not sure. I don't know if you can see that in the picture right up in here. Yeah, you can. See right there? It almost looks like a like an imprint but you don't feel it with your finger but there's definitely it's definitely different right there just show you that before you get it so you don't think I put a pen mark in it or something see how but once I turn it this way it's gone for the most part you can see it right there it's almost like it's under the gloss that is not numbered well wow. But that's listed under the photo variation, so there must be different um, inserts with those, too. Let me see. What's that number? 244. So that's just a refractor. Yeah, because the other ones are all, um, the other ones are all numbered. So it's orange, gold minted. And then a super refractor, or a super fractor, sorry.
But just so you know, just so you see that again, it's right up there, right above his. They've been pretty, um, Tops is pretty good with sending things back too if you ever wanted to. If you wanted me to, I can always do that too. I can always send it back to them and say I had an error. Matt Chapman. Gleaton Kershaw. Kyle Hendricks. Abraham Toro. There's a Frank Thomas, the big hurt. He's a big dude, man. I was looking at his college pitchers like I almost should have played football. Oh, there's the, auto, the other auto snuck up on me. Trent Grisham. I know yesterday um, Jordan was looking for him. And there's another red. Jesus Lazardo, though. That's pretty good. Can you put those in the cover and stuff? Yeah. All right, let's finish this up. Going nice and slow. We have time. This is it Kevin Biggio? Dakota Hudson. I'm going to go through them again, though, just to make sure of the photo variations. This is Bobby Bradley. Hey, Andrew, we don't, want, we don't want to see that kind of stance after a swing. Unless he launched it. If he launched it, that's cool. There's an Acuna. J.D. Martinez, he definitely launched one there. You can see it in his eyes. Sam Hillard. There's a Victor Robles coming up. That is not numbered. Yeah, so let me know if you want me to um, do that, Adam. I don't mind doing that. I've already sent him a couple of them. Babe Ruth, Barry Zito, Anthony Rizzo, Phil Castro, Kyle Yastrzemski. I don't know who that catcher is behind him, but that dude's a huge beast. Jesus. Yaz wasn't a small guy. Isan Diaz, Yoan Moncada. This is a nice Frank Thomas power zone. Not numbered, but it is an insert. Hmm. Akiyama. Travis Dimitri. Yeah, oh, look at that pit. That's actually a nice one. I remember seeing that one before, the Veritech. That's awesome. And a Nomar. How weird is that for both of them to be on the same back-to-back? -back? I know you're going to say I'm nuts, but I think out of all those shortstops back then, Nomar was actually the best. I think he got a bad rap because he actually had better range than them, and he would get to things that they couldn't get to. His problem was meeting uh, Mia Ham. There's another Aquino. Jonathan Villar, Tyler Glass now. That's going to be one of those, right? Yep, there you go. Kind of getting good at these, huh? Ken Griffey Jr., look at that catch. You definitely got some air on that one. Tommy Edmond. Another Lazardo. Wow, we didn't get any, um, oh, there's a shiny thing coming up. We didn't get any Roberts. Oh, Anthony Rendon. What is that? It's almost got like a, um, I don't know if you remember the old sports flicks, but it's got that kind of look to it. That is not numbered. Still different though. I'm gonna to have to look that. It's a Stadium Club Chrome. So 
So that's going to be an insert. Actually, was that one of the ones I said to look for? I'm sorry, I just want to check real quick. I don't see it there. I mean, it's definitely an insert. It's just, I thought it was going to be better than that. Noah Syndergaard. That's one of those emperors of the zone. No number. Salvador Perez. And a Marcus Simeon. Well, we didn't get any really sick autos, but... Is that what that was, a refractor? Yeah, it's got a weird look to it. Let me see those right there, Sam. Yeah. And the other one. I just want to take a look at these real quick just to see if I've missed one. So there's your auto. There's your other auto. Okay, yeah, and the in the wings was definitely numbered. We saw that. The blue was numbered. The Ichiro with the weird little divot in it. And you can't fill it though, which is weird. <clears throat> Let me just take a quick look through these. Crash and burn. Yeah, the mug the Mike Trout crash and burn or whatever it was. Wasn't numbered. Ichiro Castillo. You did get a Kyle Lewis. AJ Puck. Yeah, that's weird. I thought that one was number two. The Gavin Lux. Not numbered for that. No. Top loader. And this one. Who do you think is going to get rookie of the year? Kind of, do you think they're going to put asterisks next to the things for this year? Just to like, I, I mean, I don't think they should, but it's going to look weird on your stat sheet. Oops, sorry about that. I just want to run through them real quick. And I'm just going to go through these real quick. just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Oh, you know what? Let me see that black one, too, again. I did want to see that. They probably already put it away, but... It was definitely a black one. The black one wasn't numbered. I, don't I just looked through them all, and I didn't see a number on them. Yeah, that was a Vladdy. The black one was a Vladdy. But I wonder if it's more white. I mean, I guess I wouldn't call that a white. That's a black and silver. Yeah, Lewis is going to be awesome.
Which is crazy that the Robert's are still going up in price. Well, you know, I mean, his is still going up in price too, which are good, but they're still a lot higher. It's so hard to find the autos and stuff in here without you seeing them because they sneak up on you. It's all right. At least we know how to share these now, which is good. I was telling you, I wasn't going nuts. I was looking at my... Um, Yeah, you're probably right. I was going crazy looking. I'm like, there's no share button on here. He almost looks like Mookie Betts a little bit right there. Ryan Reynolds. Definitely a little taller. And Is he tall? Let me see. Yeah, he's definitely taller than Mookie Betts. All right. <clears throat> Damn, we need to get the Kyle Lewis auto. That would have been nice. Sorry, I'm just bagging these up, Adam. This is pretty cool, though. At least you got one you, you want, you know. All right, let's get the good stuff in the in the next one. Actually, that wasn't a bad box, though. I just would have liked to see some better autos. Oops, I almost screwed that up. I gotta get used to doing things right. I gotta do it properly. down here yeah there we go I forgot to transfer it <coughs> sorry about that I did not mean to cough into the mic I tried to mute it but I didn't get it in time These are nice looking cards though, huh? It's too bad like the um the albums are bad for them, but these would look sweet in like an album. It'd look almost like a photo album instead of baseball cards. That's how old I am. I still remember when the first stadium club came out and they were. What the hell did I just hit? And we all had to have them. <clears throat> now they're all drunk because it was the uh, the crappy era. But they're still cool to have. Like I'm, I'm sure there's some that if you get them graded, they're probably worth something.
No, definitely. Like, you would think these are worth a lot more. I mean, it, just because of the way they look, but... In my opinion, that's the way all cards should be. I don't want, I don't want to see these, like, uh... This one, two, three, four. This one, two, three, four. I hate seeing these, like, 800-plus boxes. I'd love to see what the distributors get them for, um... Before they sell to the middlemen. One, two, three, four. That was a weird feeling pack. And I don't think they have those those blanks in here. So there's your empty box. <clears throat> Alright, let's move those. Yeah, that probably looks a little a little thicker. Let's get like a uh, Kyle Lewis on this. This would be sick. I wonder if you can get autos with these. That'd be cool. Probably not. It's a pipe dream. Nope, it's a Max Scherza. Still a nice, a nice picture though. And it's nice because you know, how, like usually the big cards there, cheesy, like cheaper stock. These are actually just same stock as the um, the regular cards. Uh, I think I think Sam was trying to do that. I think she was trying to invite a bunch of them. I put a um, I put a message over there, and then I think she she linked the uh, this page to it. <clears throat> that was kind of a crappy screw up, but I didn't know that. I didn't know that you can't have a you can't share from a private page. I mean, it makes sense, I guess, because if you had people in there that. You know, one to remain anonymous or private. If you put it out on a on a public link, it's not gonna not gonna be nice. Because that's what it was saying. You can go from a if you had a um, public group, you can change it to a private group, but you can't change a pri um, private back to a public. I mean, maybe if you dropped all the members out, you could, but it was easier just to create a new one. I think that was the same picture as the other one. Now I'm looking for all these photo variations. I ended up turning the monitors a little, like I said. I, I didn't move them all the way over, but definitely a lot better. Seth Brown. Kershaw. You know what's going to be crappy is I bet you in like another week we're going to see the mosaics down to like six something. How much you want to bet in another week? Because they've already dropped a lot. I mean, when they first come out, you were seeing them at nine plus. And then they dropped down to... um. Like 875, 850, and then they, they've been gradually uh, just dropping. I was surprised to see them already drop again. Okay, so none of the other ones are numbered them like that. It'd be nice to get one of the super ones. They're like a rainbow one, I think it said. I have not seen one of those yet. But the blue out of the 50 was pretty cool. That was nice. to, And it was a showy, so that was good. This is a Jordan Alvarez. I don't think that's the photo variation, though. Let me see, because the, there is a photo variation of him. See. 
Yeah, there is a photo variation. It doesn't say which one. Uh, there's a full gallery. Hold on. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow. It's so there's an Aquino one too. There's one with I don't know if you're looking, but there's one with him um, running the bases, and then there's another one with him with his uh, fist up in the air in the red uniform. Yeah, so the so the variation of this one is it looks like the same picture but from another view. Yeah, so it looks like this picture but with another view. It, it's like from a different angle, but it's that same exact picture. Yeah, that'd be sick. No one Ryan. All right, let's get some good ones. This mat's nice. It lets them slide nice and easy. It's not rough on them. Logan Allen. There's a Mookie Betts. I don't think I saw that one in there. I think, the, oh, no, the, the actually, uh, no, the variation of the Nolan Ryan's different. It has them signing. You know what? I think you've got, I think the Zach, um, actually the Nick Solak, I think is a, on the other pack was a photo variation. I'm going to have to go through that again, like I said. Because I remember him being in the batter's box. Ah, uh, see this, yeah, so this is the regular one. There's one with him with a hard hat that's a um, photo variation. <clears throat> yeah it is at least like the Don Ross shows it on the back you know what I mean so you, you can tell Chipper Jones I'll go through them all and I'll I'll, I'll, I'll put them all in um, top loaders all the photo variations DJ LeMayhew otherwise I could I'd sit there all night going through these okay Arosa Arena but it's a red I was trying to pronounce that but I gave up. Is that same Ken Griffey? Yeah, see, so the Ryan, the photo variation of him, with, it has him sitting down doing the auto. So that's not the photo variation. Lewis, the... Dietrich, Sean Murphy, Johnny Gray, there's a Nick Solak. So we'll see this one. This one we... Yeah, so see, that's not the photo variation, but it's a red. <clears throat> the photo variation has him, a bigger view of him in the batter's box. Trevor Bauer, Joey Votto. And like I said, the, the same thing with the Alvarez. The photo variation has him further away. It's from a different angle. Contreras, Cal Ripken Jr., that's going to be the night that he, he um, broke Gehrig's record. That's the only thing I can think of there. It's funny because you say some of those records, they're like, oh, they'll never be broken. Hilliard. It's funny because the autos aren't backwards. So this is... Yeah, see, this isn't numbered, so this is a regular black then. <clears throat> Salvador Perez, Semyon, Grandal, Logan Webb, Miguel Cabrera, Kyle Tucker. There's one of those refractor uh, Mookie Bats. Not numbered, but still nice. That's that's not even numbered. 
It's hard to tell with these black ones. They almost look white at first when you turn them over. Jeff Bagwell. AJ Puck. <clears throat> Johnny Bench. Eloy Jimenez, I'll say. I'll say it right. There's an Aquino. Villar. Maurice Dubon. That's a better auto. I love that they're on card, too. Actually, there was an article I was going to send you today, too, that was talking about those. That there's a... Um, I mean, I knew they, they had them out, but you got to wonder if some of the autos are done by the auto pens there. They said the only way to tell is... Um, to have an expert look at it and they'd be able to tell you if it was an auto pen but that'd be dirty right Brantley that's a red Ty Cobb imagine that oh, half of the autos here would just all you gotta wonder there's a lot of them like can you imagine these kids sitting there some of them don't have attention spans to do that okay Verlanda, that's a cool picture. Verlanda. Uh, Nico Horner. Freddie Freeman. Oh, and there's your other auto. Sam Hilliard. So these autos were better than the other one. Colorado. Let's hope we get you another one. They don't usually have extras, though. Escobar Red. Santana. Aaron Judge, fist bumping you. There you go. Real Mudo, Mato, Mudo, Sheldon Noose, Gary Sanchez, Dansby Swanson, or Pete Alonzo Power Zone. I know these can have um, special ones too. I was looking. Mitch Garver, Justin Dunn, William Calhoun, Ozuna, and Jeff McNeil. <clears throat> well, we got the autos pretty quick right there. The other one took us a while. All right, here comes the nice insert. Another Michael Chavez, Dale Murphy. What is that? Bryce Harper Power Zone. Not numbered though. Matt Chapman, Clayton Kershaw, Kevin Brown. Oh, Seth Brown. I'm sorry. Why did I say that? Kevin? Old Texas pitcher. Barry Larkin, Colton Wong, it's a Gehrig, oh, and you got a backwards, oh, Vladdy, numbered out of 99, 15 out of 99, so that's in the wings, and that's a dark black, like, the other one has like a little bit of silver in it, or a gray, this one's got a tiny bit, but that's a solid black, so that's got to be a different, I mean, it's definitely numbered. And actually, you know what's weird? We got the same thing earlier, the, the in the wings back to back like that. So 15 out of 99. That's a Vladdy, so. Hmm. And these ones, like I said earlier, too, these actually look better, too. Justin Turner, David Wright, Kittle Marte, Domingo Labia, Robbie J, Goldschmidt, there's another backwards one, Gio Rochella, it's a red. Alex Young. 
Christian Walker, Jalen Toro. Wow. No Louis Robert at all in this. I shouldn't say that. We still got a little bit left. Solaire. Anchoro. There's a nice Acuna. Not numbered, but it is an insert. Hicks. Josh Bell. Oh, there's a Dylan Cease. Wow. No Louis Robert so far. He's got to be in there, though, right? He's got to be in there. Can I bring my top load up? <clears throat> All right, let's finish this off on a good thing. Molina. I noticed a bunch of them at doubles, too. Ricky Anderson. I don't know if you, you collect how long ago you started collecting, but that used to annoy the crap out of me when you get a box and it was all doubles. Austin Hayes. We got one of his earlier. Remember that background? There's a showy. Will Ca Willie Castro, Kali Yastrzemski, same catcher, Kyle Hendricks, Kirby Yates, Stan Musial. Andrew McCutcheon, and that is a red. Seems like every time these are backwards, they're a red. Machado and Woodruff Harvey Josh Donaldson he got low 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 Anthony Rizzo Starlin Marte Corey Seager playing at Fenway Justin Verlander, this is going to be one of those. Oh, not Babe Ruth. Yep, the Emperor's of his own. Oops, sorry. Did not damage that. Just so you can see. Butterfingers. Corners are still good. Babe Ruth. I don't know what that pose is called. But you know he didn't catch that like that. That's just a weird pose. That was a, hey guys, snap the picture. Harry Zito. That's a nice. Yeah, no, you're right, it does. They fill them with doubles and then the inserts are harder to get. Jock Peterson. There's another Tatis. And a Springer, red. Again, backwards. Mike Soroka. That no, that was no, that was the wrong one. Never mind. All right, this is Zach Collins. Let me check this one because I'm pretty sure there was a. There's a Zach Collins too. You know what? Which Acuna did we get? No, I would have. I would have remembered that one. Oh, the showy ones. Him sitting on the bench. Oh, so that is. That's weird. All right, well, I thought it was that, but it, it's almost the same exact position of um, Solak. That's probably why I recognized it right away. Yeah, no, there's not. That's weird. 
He's if I showed you the picture, you'd be like, it's almost like it's an exact thing, but he's just in the um, left-handed, I mean right-handed side of the batter's box. Dustin May, that's a nice picture too. Castellanos, Ken Seiko, Clemente. Here's another showy. You got a bunch of showies in these two boxes. Emperors of the Zone. Hey, Gavin Lux. Didn't we get a different Gavin Lux earlier? No, there was a Kyle Lewis coming into the batting box. That's right. I mean, coming into the dugout. You, Davis. Wow, that was kind of a not-so-fun one. Damn, I was expecting a big hit out of those. Sam, you should have said good luck. You didn't say good luck. That's the problem. Yeah, luck second to the last card. I'm going to go through them all again, though, Adam, just to see, like, because I'm sure I missed some photo variations. There's so many of them. They really should mark them. It's hard to remember everybody. Yeah, I don't know. Hope they're not in the other group still. Yeah, because there's a bunch of them. They're nice cards, though, for cheap cards. They're not cheap, like, uh, as in material-wise. I just wonder, like, how they're going to be in the long run, because, like I said, I, I have some, um, some of the Topps Finest when it first come out, and I'll, I'll show you one in a second, actually. It's fading. <clears throat> I think I'm just going to have to get into other groups and just start inviting, get other people to share. I mean, everybody's in another group. Talk to the admin in there. I think the more we get out, the... Like I said, the first weekend, I didn't really expect to do much. So, I'm happy with what we did. I mean, I'm happy with what you did, but... Yeah. Jesus. What I do with these ones too, Sam, I forgot to tell you, is I start with the top loaders in the back, the furthest in the back, then I'll put the penny sleeves, and then I'll put the um, the regular in front of the penny sleeves. Mm -hmm. If that makes sense. Just, yeah, I get you. I think we just need a little bit wider. Just with these behind us, I think we're In the front, yeah. Just gives it a little extra protection. Yeah, and give me two seconds. I'm gonna grab some uh, some of those so I can show you those.
All right, so as I move on, it's funny because these weren't even numbered. This is an old Pedro. Look at that thing. Look how young he is. Yeah, he's got the uh, he's got the soul glow going on. That's when they said he couldn't pitch. Jerry Rice, Willie McGinnis, rookie. Oh, he has the football one. But look how faded that is. He looks almost like white there. Barry Bonds, Barry Bonds. There's a Joe Carter rookie. Even that's fading a little. I guess everything fades with time. Greg Maddox, Montana, La Piazza. I used to do card shows. I used to get tables at card shows. I did pretty good. I was only a teenager then, too. <clears throat> Trying to find that Aquino. Oh, there you go. I don't know if you have this one or not. <clears throat> that was out of one of the first few packs I opened, too. Not numbered. You'd think it was, though. It looks nice and pretty. I don't even know what they're going for. I haven't even looked up anything on them. But I'll do something for you. So one of the um, local card shops, right? We're in there getting cards once. And, and uh, I got a vending box. Because I wanted the... Um, what do you call it? The Mattingly Rookies? I mean, I have some, but... I wanted some more. And the, uh, what do you call it? The guy was like, yeah, you know, back, it was an old guy too. And he's like, back in the day, I told someone, if there's not a Mattingly in there, then, you know, then you ought to get back. You're, you're going to be uh, going back to work and uh, making up all that money that you just took because there's always Mattingly's in those. So I bought two of them off him, right? Not a single one of those boxes had a, a Mattingly in it. I was almost going to go back there and be like, yeah, really? <clears throat> oh here's one of the basketball ones but look at this look at that David Robinson isn't that crappy that's horrible the basketball faded way more than the other ones and that was an insert too Was it Roger Clemens insert? That was a nice one. <clears throat> so there you go. This is my Curtis Martin rookie. Not worth nothing. Oh, hey, do you have this one? Do you have that one for Legacy? No, they definitely are. Yeah, if you don't have that one, let me know too. Oh, you do got that one? Okay. I'd be surprised if you have, if I have any of them that you don't have. Jesus. You definitely have a ton of burrows, I'm pretty sure. 
You got all the good ones too. <clears throat> That's how I was though with like uh, strawberry and good and. Do you get a lot of your singles off eBay? I'd just be afraid. Like, I already... Did I tell you I got screwed on eBay before? Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. That's kind of a good idea. Good call. Good watch. The, um... I bought a, um... Oh, thank you. I got a, um couple Mattingly cards you know the tops 2020 I got one of those and there was one that was drawn by an artist it was like out of 25 or whatever the artist's um, signature on it so I got them cheap like 30 bucks and I'll show you the stuff the dude sent me I gotta find it it's hilarious like I mean it was just like how the hell like I was like dude how do you even mix those up like he, that's what he told me. He mixed them up. I'm sorry. I mixed them up. I'll send them out to you right away. It's like, no, you're not, you liar. And then he just ignored me. So I did a dispute. Yeah, he sent me like these homemade cards. I was like, you kidding me, dude? He sent me one of them, one of the 2020s. But then the other one was definitely uh, not there and. And I even said to him, I was like, uh, thanks for these crappy Mattingly's that you sent me that dime a dozen, but uh, where's the where's the nice one? I got screwed on eBay a long time ago, too. I used to sell items from games. Yeah, I know they definitely do. I used to sell um, items from games on there, and someone bought like an in game house off me, like 700 bucks, and transferred the house in game, did all that, and then they did a. Um, they did a reverse payment, so they never got it. I couldn't prove it. What is that? Oh, that's that diamond king. I couldn't prove it, so good luck. So it was a virtual item. After that, I was like, done. I was reading one yesterday that some guy um, sent like a bunch of packs. And then the guy said he they were the wrong thing, so he or they were opened or something, so he sent them back. And when the guy opened the box up, it was a box of books. That's why I said I'm kind of nervous about selling the um, the case on there, because I could just picture something like that happening. Even if you weigh it, they could weigh it to you know, they could put a bunch of books in there or something like that just to weigh it down to exactly what you want. It. This Kobe here, I had, um, wasn't even sleeved up or anything in my stuff. I gave my daughter one of the other, um, one of his rookies. I didn't care for the Lakers back then, so I didn't sleeve up their cards. These were really nice. I know you, the older cards don't always look nice, but these were nice. These were the, um, the Pinnacle Museum Collection. And these were nice cards. <clears throat> I 
I forget which one. It wasn't expen it wasn't one of the big big ones. Is Ramirez sports flick? Good. I thought I was the coolest shit in the world when I got this. I gotta put this in a new case. It's a Frank Thomas Leaf Limited. Look at that case, it's all beat up though. But it was like back then they didn't number cards, and this was like one of the first ones that I that I got out of ten thousand. Had a sticker on it. Are you sure you don't have to? Like they I definitely want to see what those look like, but I probably have more basketball cards somewhere. I didn't really collect them. I wasn't a basketball collector. I just grabbed them because I was just, I think baseball was all uh, like already out for a while and it was getting kind of boring. But yeah, I'll look up this. I'll let you know. This one, that is a nice looking one though. I'm surprised it's not numbered though, right? But it's on card too, which is nice. All right, let me know uh, which one you're thinking of. Because I've been picking the wrong ones. My hand is cold. I don't know why this keeps beeping. I turned it off. Thank you, Adam. Especially it being that, that color and it's it looks like a cracked ice, right? It's definitely a cracked ice. You can see it. All right, last time I went with the one in the front first. No, actually, no, I didn't, right? No, because I took the one. Sitting. Let's go with the one in the front first. There we go. This one's going to have the, the nice things right off the bat. That's actually a pretty good price on these, too. Let's do this. Time's going by uh, slow tonight. It's good though. At least we got um, that stuff fixed out. That's funny that that's what it was though earlier with the um, the ban hammer they gave me. Not the ban, but they silenced me from making things. I even wrote to them too. I was like, I'm trying to like trying to get a website going I'm trying to get things working and you guys are like blocking me there you go it's all good though at least I learned now that you said that you'll get a uh what do you call it, a Kyle Lewis, or a, I know you won't complain about them. I was watching them open these, and they always took the, I think it was the top two packs, and moved it to the back when I was watching them break them. They must do that for a reason, but we shall see. Yeah, I think tomorrow what I'm going to do is I'm going to message a few of the admins from the other groups that said uh, um, to get it approved first. 
and I'll try doing that. See if I can get it approved. I mean, that group that I did is pretty good, but we, I usually hit them early. There's a lot more people on. Oh, these are kind of nice looking. It's too bad we couldn't make the group public, but everything else private. I don't know why they don't allow that, but that's how you get trolls and stuff like that. But I guess as long as they can't comment, it don't matter. And I'm pretty, I'll go through the settings again, make sure I did everything right. Let's do these ones first. Let's let these ones heat up a little. Just want to make sure I didn't pick up an auto or anything. Ryu. Paradis. That's definitely an insert. Not numbered, but it's a lot thicker too. I don't know if you have any of these yet, but it's a lot thicker than the other ones. And right behind that was his regular one too. Hearn, Molina, Diaz, that Cruz, it's a nice looking card, Arizona Fall League, hmm, that's cool. Harrison, Pete Alonzo, Seth Brown, Dawn of Glory, Kevin Smith. Nice looking card. Not numbered. Fez and Cabacho. So what is it? One auto um, per side, right? Keston Hira, Baez, Shimake, Adina, Joe, Charlie Blackman, and here's a, oh, there's one of your autos right there. It is numbered 441 out of 499. Gunnar Meyer, Mayer. Oh, right behind him is a Bobby Witt Jr., though. It does say Bowman first up in the corner. It is a nice one for you, Bobby Witt Jr. Alvarez, AJ Puck, Josh Allen. Okay, that's a nice one. Refractor. Is that different on the... Oh, no, it isn't. Okay. And that is number 212 out of 499. Is it 212 or it looks like 212. Diaz and Sami. Can you talk about those ones? Let me see if this works. All right, come on. Kind of funny that he asked about him because uh, I've never heard somebody PC in him yet. So, but I've got some weird PC. So, it's 
the Jordan Alvarez right there. Pache in this one. It's a funky arm angle. That'll be it. Yep. Garrett Cole. Oh, there's one of your auto. There's your auto right off the bat. That's why they move those. So the top two packs do go to the back. Luis Matos is not numbered. But that's an on card. That one felt a little thicker. Doesn't look any different though. Ruiz. Rindon, there's a blue one coming. Strasburg. That is numbered out of 150. I don't know if you can see that. Kind of hard right there, right where his foot is. Nice card, though. There's the Pache. I don't know why it keeps doing that. It keeps automatically going on autofocus. All right, there we go. So Jordan Alvarez, John Means. Hmm. Not really impressed with these ones yet. They're nice cards. They're nice stock, but they're just not... Uh, not wowing me. Bryant. There's another one of those Fall League ones. Arizona Fall League. Terrain. Libertori. Savali. Here's a, oh, this is a nice looking one coming up. Kluber. Larnack, but that's a nice looking card. Not numbered though. It's a nice looking card though. Surprise it's not numbered. Materials, Vientos, there's the Grisham. Posey, Doyle. Tavares and Marte. Wow. Yeah. These ones here are going on the uh, top loaders. Okay. Damn, Adam. I am sorry on that one. I thought that, um, what's that? I think it's fine. Yeah. It's usually like the patches and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah you need a thicker one for Actually, that was an insert, too. Let me get that out of there. The ones with the three on top loaders? Yeah, this one. Yeah, you might as well. These are nice cards. I'm going to look through these again, too, just to make sure I didn't miss something. The top loaders, too? Yeah. No, it looks like I got them all. Not a lot of inserts in these. That's kind of weird. Let me read the box again. See what the odds are. No, no, definitely. The autos weren't bad at all. They were better than that, that first one. Alright, so
That's weird. It's saying that the... I think it's the numbered purple ones, a one out of 46 packs. It might be even those, though, because the way they're wording it, it's kind of weird. There's an orange. Wow, holy crap. Some of these uh, super refractors. One out of 272,000. Uh, no, just for. Oh, let me see them. Yeah, might as well. Sorry. Should be over here. These ones. Might be getting open. I think I only took like one out of that. I'm so not used to wearing glasses that when I look up, it makes me freaking dizzy. There might be some in there that are new. Yeah. Thank you, Adam. I appreciate that. That's going to be my job tomorrow. Looking for other groups to research and see if I can um, let them. Let me share. I know there's a bunch of them that do allow you to do it, but it's just the uh, fact of finding them. Every one that I seem to look through is right in the rules. It says do not, uh, without without admin permission, I mean, at least. Some of them don't allow it at all, which makes sense if you're doing it yourself. You know what I mean? Why would you want other people bouncing in? Get these all bagged up. Hopefully, once some of these other guys pop in too, they'll start inviting other people. Yeah, some of them are straight up. They'll say right away, not sharing. Do not share or else you'll get banned instantly. All right, let's get that last one. All right, let's get that Akuna.
What I might do is um, end up popping off after a little bit and then uh, trying to work on that stuff too right now on the website. That'll be nice to get that going because then at least people can, I can track people a little. Yeah, I was looking at it. She um she had the background white before, and I think it looks a lot better black. But like I said, it's nothing fancy or anything, but it's better than I was going to do. You can't go wrong for the money. So there's your box. packs let's try it a different way this time Sammy say good luck this time please That's what I'll do too. Like I said, uh, I got some homework to do in the morning. And then once I'm done, I'm going to just start messaging groups. Show at least that we have a couple of videos. You know what I mean? We could show them that we're not just this little thing. There's an Akuna right there, but not the auto. He's a pretty big dude, huh? Zach Collins. Dunn. My daughter got her driver's license today, so she's all like pumped, want to drive everywhere. That'll wear off pretty quick. I haven't seen him in a while. That's a nice one to get right there. That's a good one. That's a lot. I'm a lot happier seeing that. You didn't mention his name, though, but I haven't seen one of them pulled in, a, in quite a while, actually. And we'll probably get the auto right away because I screwed up. Arenado, Greta Roll, Canan Smith. Gore. Kellenick, Dustin May, Brendan McKay, Kyle Isbell, Jay Groom. I know he was a, a lot of high hopes on him, but he had Tom, I think he had Tommy John or something, some surgery when he first came out. His first year, he was moving along pretty good too. There you go. This is Jason Dominguez. Yeah, what's good is she's learning. I got her a manual. She wanted to drive a manual, so she can't drive it yet, but she's out driving my car instead. Sean Murphy, Tony Gonsolin. Wow. Sam Hoff. I wonder if he's related to Aubrey. Could be a son, right? He 
He looked kind of old, though, for a young dude. Yeah, I haven't seen a Dominguez pulled in a while. Like, even before. Like, I'm talking months. Probably the past month I haven't pulled one. Gorman, Muller, Zach Gallen, and there's a Sean Murphy. Well, that's a low number, too. Well, not really. I lied. It looked like it said 009. It is a 09, yeah. Number 9 out of 150. Sean Murphy. It's not a bad one. Lindau. Clark Schmidt. Hayes. Dunn. Yamamoto. Florentino. The helmet looks a little too big for him. Not numbered. Oops, wrong file. Harris, Velade, Zach Collins, Freeman, and here's a Shogo Akiyama, and that is numbered 405 out of 499. And that looks like a refractor. Yeah, you can definitely see it more on the, the screen. Well, this box is a lot, lot nicer. Jensen, Aiken, there's your Acuna. JD, Jaron Duran, Faido, Rizzo, Lindor, Vidal Brujan. So that's all Fall League guys. That's kind of cool. You could have one of those guys hit. Hold on one second. I just want to make sure. All right, these can be sleeved and be sleeved and popped out. Wow, that whole time I'm talking to you and I had it on mute. I am so sorry. Was it which one was it that you were talking about the Ranger? Was it the not the auto? <clears throat> Laura? Or Laura? Oh it is, okay. I'll top load that for you then. Yeah, if you see any that I miss like that, let me know. Please. 
I don't want to send you something in a sleeve and it should have been top loaded. I'm surprised he's on Ember though, huh? That's crazy. He must have been like, what the hell is he doing? Like, just showing me cards? What the hell's wrong with this guy? Yeah, I went to cough, so I hit the thing, and then I forgot to hit it back again. Capusano. Longoria. He's getting up there in age, too. Look at that. He's looking right at the ball. That's what you should be doing. Chapman. Yeah, please. Oh, right behind him is a Casey Mize. I know that's a nice one. Archer Jimenez. Semyon Juan Soto. Oh, hey, I know you're going to be happy with that one. You're going to be psyched with that one. That's what you're looking for, right? That's what you're looking for? Looks nice too. Sharp corners. Do you want that in a one touch? Yeah, I'll put this in a one touch for you. That's what you we were talking about that time. I was I thought you was kidding until you showed me the article. Yeah, the corners are nice on it, too. Nice card. There you go. Get that all in a one touch for you. Congrats, man. That's awesome. That's the one you were looking for, too. You called it. You said it on the other box, but... But it was sitting in this one, waiting for you. Wow, you would have been pissed if you didn't get that other one and someone opened this. That's why I hate this this hobby. I mean, I love it. Don't get me wrong, but I hate when I see somebody open something I was chasing. Yeah, the corners, even in this, it looks nice. You'll definitely be sending this one out to be graded. Sweet looking card. We haven't even finished going through them, but I know that, that would have made you happy right there. This can be on top loaded too. Is it top loaded? Yes, please. Dunning, Shumaki, Yellick, Clevinger, and this one's out of 250. See, it's funny, these ones are actually numbered, but the other one isn't. 131 out of 250. Whitley and Nolan Jones. Well, there you go. Congrats, man. I know. Isn't that funny? Last night it was the burrow. Now tonight it's the uh, the Acuna. You've been chasing that one too. You've been looking for his cards. I know you were saying that. Did you find any on eBay?
Okay, we're going to let that sit there for a little while. While I clean these up. Well, you don't have to look for this one now. That's a nice auto, too. He actually has a nice auto. It's not like one of those crappy, like that, what was that guy we saw yesterday that had like the circle with the, an initial inside of the circle that wasn't even part of his name. That was kind of odd. Some room on that one. Mm -hmm. Gotta find me. <laughs> Slacker. Thank you, Adam. I appreciate it, man. I was kind of bummed out on that other box. I was really hoping to get something good there. You got some room. In, yeah, I was gonna say you have some room in that other bag, right? Yeah, take some of these ones. No, no, thank you, Adam. You can see my fan going in the background because I had to turn the AC off. Hmm. I said that last night. You had four cars line up in a row. And I don't see anybody in front of me. That's the only thing that stinks is the camera light. You see that reflecting in there? If I can hold it off the side a little, get rid of it. I think it's taping. I know. I don't know if you can hear that noise in the background, but it's the tape dispenser. You can because I watched the live last night. I was looking to see how it sounded. It sounds like we have like, a, like an old wheel or like a... Like a water wheel going in the background. We live on an old farm. <laughs> That's cool. I didn't even know he had a brother, though, until you said that before. Oh, damn it. Just inside. Oops. There was a small one here. Oh, was there? Uh, it's it's probably clean. Yeah, you're not kidding me. Like, I might have to call a freight company. That's what's nice about that flat rate stuff, though, because as long as it's not up to 70 pounds, that's not bad, you know? Well, that's good. At least we fixed a few things tonight. Got a few more bugs out. Really, I've never even heard his name. Like, I guess I got to do a little more research. I mean, I hear all the big ones, but I was surprised to hear him say, like I said, Grisham yesterday. And I know he's a decent player, but. Some of these young guys.
It's funny because it used to be the Dominguez's, right? They were like big time. Then the Robert's. Robert's still going strong though. Oh no, definitely. I didn't expect to have a lot this weekend. That's why I didn't put any other delivery in. But I do have some coming in for next weekend. Like the new stuff especially. I want that, you know, on release day. Oh, Jeff is trying to get in? Is he, uh... He actually kind of got my thing for my thing. Hey, Adam, can you send um Jeff Mathias a um, invite to this? We'll explain to him. Well, that'll be good because I was going to ask him. I can always go on my phone and do it. Let me see. He had commented on um, Sammy's post on the other group. I should have gone on and just sent them all invites right away. I just wanted to get up and running. You know, it's funny, as early, I didn't even see you sending me the invite to my regular account. I was having all kinds of trouble trying to do that. And then all of a sudden I looked up and I'm like, oh, he already did it. Nice. Yeah, I think the other way is to just copy and paste like the invite thing, but then you still have to send it to them. It's too bad, like I linked the other group, so you think it would be able to just pull people right over. I'm trying. Hey, Dad, how's your Instagram? Can I jump on here? Because I know it's a little busy. I 
Yeah, yeah. Yeah, some people have, like, I have that on my regular profile. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to write to him. I was going to answer back on that post. I know what, we, what I can do. Go here. Yeah. I think it's safe. Yeah, I just sent him an invite on um, through Messenger so he can go in that way. It wouldn't let me um, add him, though. That was kind of weird. So it was doing it to you, too. Sammy was trying as well. He must be like like my regular profile I have private. Actually, I can do it this way, too, just in case he doesn't, because my messages could be going to his um, spam box. Mm. Right, you want to go here, copy link. <clears throat> Yeah, he's probably got it private, that's why. <clears throat> yeah. I know, I'll probably have to delete that. Like, once we get everybody moved over then I'll probably just delete that because it's going to be confusing. Like even when I was trying to uh, get the stream going earlier, it kept bouncing to the private one. I wish I had known that before though about the private. I mean, we could still, like I said, it's good that we can still control everything like that, but it would have been nice to know that up front that you can't share. You, I couldn't even get some of the programs to work.
Yeah, definitely. Like I said, I'm gonna I get the um I got the Instagram going and the Twitter too, so I'm gonna post the pictures all on there. Every time you know, right before I do shipping. I'll just take a bunch of pictures and post them up to there. Hopefully that starts attracting more people too, you know. Just use being on the other platforms. And it should be I gotta um set it up the link or whatever. So it should be streaming on the website as well once I set up the link. And it'll save all the every video to the website. So if anybody ever wanted to go back and look without having a search back on Facebook, they could just go right to the website and it'll um, have a gallery of the old videos. And she actually came up with a pretty good thing. Instead of doing the voting, um, it was just a little more in depth. What we can do is set up the pictures where people could put likes. So it'll count up the likes, you know, and that's how we'll know. It's a lot. Of, it's just the same thing. It's just not setting up a, a vote. And I'll just tally up all the likes at the end of the night and or the next day. Why do you think we should do that anyways for the daily one? Should it go until the next morning or? Or should we just get one from each? Uh, yeah, because how are you going to pick the ones from each day? Hmm. Yeah, you got. we got to do it daily. But it should, maybe we should always just have it a day behind, like um, or a day ahead, I mean. So we'll, we'll let the voting start, <clears throat> like once I get the picture up, and then it'll go until the next day when I get the picture up. And I'll try to do it at the same time every day, that way the other votes don't, uh... Oh, so you want me to pick it, and then have, that's actually a better idea, huh? Because otherwise that'd be a pain in the ass, and you'd get like certain people winning all the time. That's a good idea, and then I could put them up there. And then we can uh, do the votes on Monday and Tuesday while we're off. Just let the votes tally up, and then that'll let us know the, the card of the week. That's a better idea, because otherwise it'd be a pain in the ass getting voting every day. Some people won't want to do it every day, you know. Yeah, that's a good idea. Put it right on the stand, get it like an angle view with the mat and the stand. I mean, I get a little bit of the mat. I don't want to take a whole picture with just the mat, though, so. Did you get a chance to take a look at the site or no? And it's pretty, like, I, I kind of like it because it's plain. I told her not to do anything like over the top. Okay. It's um, www.sincitybreakers.com. Uh, I got to put the rules and everything up there too. Get the terms in there. But if you click down the bottom, it'll take you right to the... Um, the Twitter feeds and yeah, don't look in the store yet. <laughs> Actually, if you want a good laugh, look in the store and look at the gallery too. Look at the gallery, she has like. Just all kinds of. Well, I know you can, but I don't want it. 
Hmm. And you guys thought I was selling baseball cards. Hmm. I'm going to disable the store until I start putting stuff on there. Actually, I might even just throw the case on there just in case somebody goes there and looking for it. Because i got to set up the... Um, the Google search engine to, to put it on there. Yeah. She probably like does a lot of, cause like a lot of the places she sent me to to look at were all like clothing or jewelry places. So she probably just has like a generic thing that she has going. But I also got to set up the members to the, um, the reward tiers. Like I said, I'd like to be able to track everybody's, you know, what everybody's buying and give them points for that too. So that way they're, uh, people are earning points and you don't have to necessarily buy it off the, uh, buy it off the site to get the points. Plus it'll give me a better idea on what people buy. I can look at someone and see like, okay, this is coming up. Maybe blast them an email, let them know, you know, what they collect the most is coming up. <clears throat> you think that's kind of confusing with the shipping or did it make sense to you? I mean, I, I tried to make it as like easy to understand as possible, but I figure that's the best way to do it is let people choose. I mean, if we get really big, it's going to be one or the other, but I think right now I don't mind. Like I said, personally, me, I'd rather spend 10 bucks and know that it's coming in a box. Because <clears throat> even that stuff like I sent to Jordan today, that was like 550 you know, so you're already going over. Would I hound him for 50 cents? No, but... I mean, boxes aren't perfect. I, I got a uh, box once, and it was like it looked like a, a no, like a T Rex or something bit into the thing. But with the bubble wrap inside, you know what I mean. I'm not just gonna throw cards in a box. It's still gonna be bubble wrapped and wrapped up good. I hate when that happens. Those things fall all the time too. Did you want any insurance on that stuff or no? I mean, you do have a couple nice, like at least three or four nice hits. <clears throat> I'll tally them all up for you and let you, I'll, I'll take, when I take the pictures, you just take a look and tell me what you think. I mean, even that three out of three, um, Jordan Love, that's a nice card. I wonder what the, did you look up the comps on that yet? That's going to be a nice one. Especially for those Packers fans. Oh, yeah, yeah. It'll probably be like 15. I mean, I, I wouldn't worry about it. <clears throat> I think that's what the last one was for you. It was like 15, and then you did 1,000 insurance. So it was, a, well, it, they give you 50, so you bought 950 insurance additional. And that was like another 15 bucks. I think if I just threw out right away, yeah, I know, I'm probably not because it's such a low number too. And still fairly new too. I wonder if that's the first one pulled. That'd be nice. Do you keep everything or do you, um, do you flip some stuff?
I always say I'm going to flip my some of the stuff that I don't really keep, but then I don't. I just store it. <clears throat> oh yeah, no, definitely. He's probably got one of the best chances out of some of those guys. I know the Patriots were looking at him for a little bit. Well, they, they mentioned it. <clears throat> Not them, but the all the media guys around here. Yeah, so you like me. I have people offer me things all the time for some of my stuff. Like Even when I did the shows, like I'd open up packs, I'd get like a sick card, and I'd get offered all kinds of stuff. I think I probably did it like two or three times. But it was just so I can get my PCs. Yeah, he's due for it. He's definitely due for that. Oh, really? Was he hanging out with, with the uh, president? Pop it with you. Oh, there's gonna yeah. be an enema. You probably just want to check it out. I thought you meant he left, left. I was like, that's weird. No. I've been under the, like, I, I hate to talk about that stuff because some people are crazy about it, but I feel like most people have already had it. It's been a longer than what we had, you know, what we were told. And there was a lot of people, like, I remember even, like, last november i got sick and i don't get sick a lot mm -hmm. and i was like it was brutal mm -hmm. but it was like quick it was like three days two or three days and it was over see for me i was sick around november because it was right after my birthday mm. and it lasted about two weeks and oh, i was wow. like as sicker than i've ever been and it was i was miserable I, I mean it's definitely a real thing but i think more of it's political just a lot of political stuff There you go. I got both of these together in the same bag for you. <clears throat> oh, not pay right back. I hit the wrong one. Be right back. There you go. Yeah, that's a nice Jordan. I mean, I know the borrow is the one you want, but that's nice, though. Three out of three. It's really nice looking, too. It's really not. I don't see any defects on it. And that's the one I have, too. One of the higher-end ones. Burrow looks like he's almost going to punt the ball there, doesn't he? I 
Or is it a marching band or something? That is funny though. The last... It was actually, what, the last... The last box last night, last box tonight. <clears throat> we gotta switch that up though. We gotta get it on the first box for now on. Then you don't have to hunt. I'm superstitious like that. If I feel like I, even if I like, I don't get them much anymore, but if you get like a scratch ticket or something and you're like, uh, you're thinking about grabbing that other one and then you watch someone else grab it and you're like, oh, they just freaking won. I know they won. I could tell they won. I was at Vegas one time and, uh, some little old lady, she wasn't even up like happy or anything. It was like. It was like 32 grand that she won on the slot machine. And, and I was just like watching it go up. And I'm like, oh my God. And she was like just sitting there like nothing happened. I'm just like. She probably didn't even know. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh my God. Like, just be happy. <clears throat> I'm just glad you got it though. That was sick. That's what you were calling too. That's why you said that when I said uh, the, the brother. That's what you were talking about. Now, I, 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 when you said that earlier, you were like, the brother. And I was like, the brother? What was he talking about? But now I get it. You were talking about the, the Akuna brother. Is he supposed to be better than him? Or still, like, I mean, Akuna is pretty good. All right, I'm going to log off in a little bit. Well, actually right now. Um, but I'll be on for a little bit. I'm going to mess around with the website. If you see anything on there like um, that you can think of that I can change up or whatever, let me know. I know I can't edit a lot of it. She's like She has it programmed. She said if I mo try to move stuff around, it will delete like certain things. So she'd have to go back in. Oh, really? But she was pretty good. She's pretty thorough. It's so funny though, you know, people around like our part of the our part of the planet or whatever, our our area, like you give somebody a tip and, and they don't appreciate it. I gave her literally all I gave her was a twenty dollar tip, right? I thought you know, it was like twenty percent or something like that. And she literally messaged me like instantly. She's like, Oh my god, like why would you give me a tip like that? And I was like, What the hell? And I looked up the the currency rate and it was the the money i paid for the website was more than a monthly income over there so she was probably like just happy for that well, it's like crazy though 20 just to hold it. <laughs> oh wow i remember when the griffies all come up there was a uh, like three of them but he was the only one who panned out i mean of course the dad was good but All right, I'm going to log off. I'll talk to you in a little bit, though. I'm going to um, head downstairs, grab something, and then I'll, I'll be back up. Like I said, I'm going to go over some of the stuff. Try to get that website. Get rid of those uh, purses and... What else was on there? Purses and clothes? Shoes. shoes. Yeah, you don't want shoes, do you? You don't need any... Watches the watches might be cool. I don't know. I mean, I, I like a little nicer watch than those, probably. But... All right, I'll talk to you in a little bit, Adam. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. And I'm glad you got what you uh, you were looking for. I'll talk to you in a little bit. I got to do the ends.